Hello class, my name is Muhammad Prince and this is my week two discussion post. The problem that I'm addressing is gun restrictive laws in California. The societal problem is whether they actually help in pre preventing mass shootings or if they infringe upon the Second Amendment rights of law abiding citizens in California and their right to protect themselves and their homes. The specific laws I am addressing is the assault weapons ban and the high capacity magazine ban. The assault weapons ban does nothing to stop the assault weapons being purchased in California. The ban also does not help with its intended purpose of stopping mass shooting incidents. The difference between an, the difference between an illegal assault rifle and a legal long gun in California is simply whether or not the rifle has a pistol grip or a thumb hole stock. It's the same exact gun, just with a different grip that can be changed in two minutes. Um, many California compliant assault rifles just have a grip wrap that can be easily removed. The assault weapons ban does not stop anyone from buying an AR-15 or an AK-47 in California. It simply forces law-abiding law -abiding California residents to buy Cali-compliant gun models that have a fin grip or thumb hole stock closed off. The difference between an illegal assault rifle and a legal long gun is simply where you put your thumb. Regarding the high-capacity magazines ban, some feel that this is pointless as well because you can buy high-capacity magazines legally in Arizona or Nevada without even showing identification. These states have no restrictive laws on high capacity magazines at all. If a person wants an AR-15 with a 100 round magazine, they can le legally buy the gun in California and um, legally buy the magazines in Arizona. The penalty for having a high capacity magazine in California is a $100 fine. There is a lot of ambiguity on whether or not these gun restrictive laws are stopping criminals from obtaining these guns or law abiding citizens. So the stakeholders are the law-abiding citizens of California. These gun restrictive laws aren't infringing upon the rights of criminals in California. These restrictive laws are infringing upon the Second Amendment right of the people who can legally buy firearms in California. These laws are limiting law-abiding citizens to, ten, to a 10-round capacity magazine. Criminals who buy guns illegally are not limited or restricted the same way these law-abiding citizens legally buying firearms are the citizens in california have a right to not be limited or restricted when it comes to how they choose to protect their family thank you for watching my video and i look forward to interacting with you all in the comments